Good morning. Right, I'm trying to get ready for work. Okay, um, this is my first update video and it's not going to be a regular a recurrence. Get in. Look at that word. Straight away. It's only 20 past 10. Um, I just thought I'll put an update video out today. Um, well, not be today. It'll be like next week sometime, but <clears throat> I kind of feel like I had to address a few things. Um, and I kind of want to address a few things that's changed with the channel. I'm very unprepared for this right now. I'm literally getting ready for work. I do have pants on. Just so you know. Um, 2024 has been a weird year. And it's about to get weirder. And it's about to get crazier. And it's basically trying to set up 2025. Um, there's been so much happen this year already. As the bus now pulls up. It's a double decker bus so I can see straight into there. Hello. Anyway, um, so much has happened in 2024 already. And I want to give a massive shout out to anyone who's involved in my personal life. Um, there's been so much happening. There's been so much. Like, there's been so many ways I could have got lost this year. Definitely. And also everyone on YouTube who watches us. Um, I'm always grateful um, for people who take time to comment. And people, even if it's random as fuck. Or someone demanding their um, data usage time for watching me back or you know whatever you know YouTube's YouTube um, but I do appreciate it and I do it just because I want to do it I don't monetize the channel um, I've been the same way I've always been since I was a kid and because I've been filming my life for so long I do struggle with um, some form of mental illness and I was getting treated for it last year and I found with all the treatment I went through, I found the fact that um, I could heal myself in a way by watching what I do, but then also, you know, if Abraham's running around or Seven's creating a master plan like Pinky in the fucking brain, I do feel like sometimes I live with multiple people in the house and it is just me physically here. But again, I find creativity but i also look at that as a challenge and i think next year particularly next year i want to make a massive challenge change um i want to change my content up i want to keep to me roots of what i love to do there's a couple of easter eggs in the background here of a couple of videos i'm working on the minute where they all kind of cross over to each other and the passion's there but i don't buy loads of stuff anymore and it's mainly because i'm running out of fucking room to put stuff but it's also the fact that obviously if you're new to the channel or not new to the channel you've been there for a while you probably realize by now that obviously me and Britt have separated and we're both going off on our own journeys of life and that's something that obviously was quite suppressed from um on the channel and i do generally wish her all the best with life and stuff like that but we had stuff to sort out around the house and that was a stressful time and believe it or not in that time as well i lost my grand to alzheimer's which was fucking devastating grueling fucking everything you can imagine and i'm still dealing with the aftermath of that of all like the kind of paperwork and stuff like that and especially with everyone else living news in new zealand and there's just me here to deal with it and then you work a full-time job on top of that and you concoct in all these crazy ideas and you do the live and local stuff and i again lonely tree being a tree in a branch of a branch of a branch and i just have so many ideas it's been cool lately just to really zone right down and um not jump on a crazy idea and do less filming like this i'm filming loads but i've just been putting the archive and i'll get to that in a minute um but it's just been it's been crazy and i think like i generally feel like now i can sort of open up a little bit about it and i'm making peace of it and there's a video coming out it's unnamed at the moment but it's um i don't know what it is but there's been vlogs of me when i've had a few drinks and my personality is completely shattered and that's going to come out but that takes mentally challenging to look at that but i think it's something i want to take on um it's also as well like the last year as well um searching for chambers movie that is out now on the channel and it's just there it wasn't promoted it was coming out dealing with the loss of mark and looking at my own mortality as well is been another thing um that's really got us so there's been a lot going on the last year and i think i've even tried multiple times to film something like this and get in the archive 
Um, but yeah. So, with that in note, um, next month, me and Matt and Joey and Garford are all going on tour. So, we'll be in Scotland, Ireland, the dates are all over social media. And then we are traveling abroad after that as well into the new year. Um, and that's an interesting project. I'm not going to tell you too much about that project yet, but that project is something I've been working on the sidelines. And some of that has snowballed into something quite um, new and adventurous for me personally. So... Keep an eye on that. Obviously, it's to do with fairly. Obviously, um, we had a big show last weekend. And something I put on as well, um, and that was playing live in the Metro Centre. And it's something I've wanted to do, and it's done. Video wise, um, the videos there's still gonna be a lot of t love for the two Corys on this channel. Um, there's a I think Felman's actually popping up in one of the new videos for this, which again I haven't had a chance to edit yet. Um, so again, it's going to be cool doing daft videos like that, and I want to actually do a new show as well about VHS, love for VHS, talking VHS, um, talking movies again, podcasts, uh, we haven't recorded anything in months, um, we will be starting to do podcasts again eventually, there's a lot of films down here that have been noted what I want to do podcasts, the main reason we haven't done a podcast, and this is me being totally honest with you, is the fact is, with my grand passing, all the aftermath of that. Um, so he still gets a spare. Um, I couldn't um, commit to two hour block of filming without any interruption or phone calls or updates of everything that was going down. So finding that time has been impossible. Um, so obviously there is time now and a lot of it. Um, so podcasts will return. Um, obviously, as well as the channel, there's going to be a pendulum shift. We are going to start bringing back um, old school stuff. Um, there is a new video coming out that's done. It's called The Bus Journey. Um, it's a missing tape fan from the tournament, which developed. Again, this took about four months to develop. Um, and it just opens up the rabbit hole, um, which is an interesting concept. And I've liked doing that kind of stuff. I find the uniqueness of it, all right? So me putting this video out now where I'm just talking, there's no overlays, there's no cut-tos. You know, my name was there, the intro was there, and now it's just me talking. The videos I want to put out, I want to be a bit more arty-farty. I want to get back into directing the music video next year, which will obviously be for fairly. Um, but again, I just feel like this year I've had no time. And I think like all the content I want to put out is random, unique. Um, I'm possibly going to start archiving a lot of stuff on YouTube as well because people do comment on the video and I'll be like, is that one of my videos? And it's, it's seriously, like someone commented the other day on, what was it? Someone commented on something the other day. And I, I couldn't even remember making the video. Now I can't even remember making the comment. But that's the kind of shit I'm talking about. I'd be like... I mean, it was cool when someone uh, commented on me Count Duckley video. And I was like, oh, I meant... I fucking totally forgot I made that. And then you watch it back. And you see this setup and you think, fucking hell. But again, like, me knowing this kind of content is what I should do. Because again, with my videos, recently... I've really enjoyed fucking around with how I mentally feel about the videos. I want you to watch the video and not even think for a moment you know what's going to come or happen or cut away or where I'm going to jump to in the past. I mean, these three videos I was talking about, they, they jump all over the place. There's about four weeks in between film and, and they're going to cross over like that. And that's something that's been mentally prepared for. Um, but again, going forward... I've always said this before, less is more, a bit more. Um, but everything I want to put out there is there. Because again, I know the channel also gets flooded with the live footage and all that. But everything I put out in this channel is my own content. It's something that I've made from the ground up, either filmed, produced. And I'm proud of it. And I'm going to keep on doing it because it's what I love to do. And even though my life keeps falling to bits around me, there's one person or multiple persons that always get me up, get me out of the house, Get me to be the person I want to be because one day I'll not be here and as long as I leave um, a positive vibe out there and that's all I would ever want, you know. So yeah, a bit more of an ending but again, that's again how I've felt the last six months of just like, fucking hell, what is life? 
and then you start thinking of believing in the matrix and you got to go to work and a car goes past you and then exactly the same car goes past you and it's um a really old car and you think what the fuck there's some strange glitches out there <laughs> see I told you anyway see you now ticks <laughs>